Before I talk about something called a control, make sure to follow my Instagram. I post some uh, pretty juicy quotes over there that, um, I don't know, it may help you in life. And I post some cool photos too, every once in a while. For everyone that thinks Japan is weird, you're right. They do some weird things over there. One of those weird things is something called kancho. Kancho is like the equivalent of pantsing in America, except there's pantsing in Japan too. There's skirting as well. But a kancho is basically where you uh, make like a Naruto hand sign looking thing, two fingers up, and you shove it up someone's asshole. Okay, not like actually up the ass, but if, if you get a good one, it should have some nice like slide through the cheeks action going on. After you get controlled hard, your pants should have a pretty deep crease in them. You probably think it's weird, but in Japan, it's, it's not weird at all. Like it's a normal thing. Kids do it to each other all the time in Japan. Kids also don't wipe sometimes though, so it might backfire a bit. If you're a Naruto fan, do you remember Kakashi's 1000 Years of Death? Lead villain secret finger jutsu! A thousand years of death! That's a control. When I lived in San Diego, the elementary school I went to had a lot of Japanese kids, or like half Japanese kids, and most of us spoke Japanese, so we all knew what a control was, so we would like always control each other from the shadows. It was the best when you sneak up behind someone in recess and get that juicy control. Satisfying stuff. All my Japanese friends did it to each other, but one day, one of my Japanese friends controlled a white kid. It's all fun and games if Japanese kids control each other, but if you control a non-Japanese kid, they gonna get freaked out. And I mean, I don't blame them. Japs are weird. So the kids started crying and told the teacher, and it actually became a big deal. Like, there had to be a parent-teacher conference with, like, both of the families. And my Japanese friend actually ended up getting suspended. To you, it might be a reasonable punishment because... I mean, he did stick his fingers up someone's butt. But to me, it's funny that he got suspended because it's like, it's a normal thing for me. Actually, my friend Jackson, back in middle school, he pants someone in a PE and he actually got suspended for a day. I feel like America's more sensitive to those kind of things, especially with like, like touching and stuff like that. In America, stuff like roughhousing or like pantsing someone is like never allowed and you'll get in trouble for doing that, but it's a lot more lenient for like, like behavior. Whereas in Japan, people are like wrestling each other in the hallways and just, you know, like playing around and you know, girls are skirting each other. But if you disrespect a teacher, you gon' get wrecked. Anyway, that's my knowledge and experience with the control. If you like the video, make sure to like the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, then do it. If you watched a full video of me without leaving, then you probably like my content. So subscribe. And make sure to click the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified when I upload. Uh, thank you guys for watching. And I like butts. Yeah. Yeah.